all the background noise that is going on instead of just deciding to mute all that. But hey, what do I know? You, you know what? Where the name of this episode is, I'll just throw that on in the background. I don't know the name of this episode. It's been like a bunch of days. Let's just been okay. So I, I know I'm episode two, but we'll shout delete a dot, delete a dot. Now we should only have this. I finished episode two. All right, we're gonna switch the name to A Long Road Ahead. Okay. Ben and the you and Kenny Lee. Right, uh, I forget how to do this. How do I do this? How do I do the ting and the ting? Sorry, I can just do it off my phone. Or I can just change the title. Hey, right, yeah, that's... I know that's a ting. But how do I do the ting? Is it this? This? Oh, here we go. Oh, I appreciate the uh, two people who joined. Ow, oh, it's fucking. I did long road head, not a head. Because I'm stupid. Alright. Empty f fields are not allowed. Ta-da! Alright, uh, right, I'm gonna start. Let's go! Oop, the fucking PS button. That's great. You know, I don't know if I said it, but I appreciate the two people who joined. Just wait for this thing to, to take forever to load. Mm -hmm. Previously mm -hmm. on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Oh, Come on! Me we up. know this guy's not gonna make it. Kenny! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Can I eat my goldfish now? Got goldfish, and they taste like strawberries, even though they say original on the package. National Guard orders evacuation of city.
Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. That's right, Kenny. Go Kenny crouches by, just walk straight over. Will Lee walk straight over? And Made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. No, I really think we should leave. Like, we've looted this entire area. And the drugstore is not drugstore. Uh, motel okay, is. just like last time. Shit. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <sighs> Fucking man, how far into the future is this? Shit. You okay? The ladders come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. One time I went up a ladder like that, it broke. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Well, the Jeep Better has gonna move on. I can see that the Jeep has a wench on it. Wait, yeah, there you go, wench. Saw it. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Wench, wench. It's not good. I'm worried. No oh, shit. Good. There's a lot to be worried about. She's gonna snap. Blocked by all the fallen concrete. I had to walk that far to look at the fucking helicopter. Oh, so much for the military. Yeah, so much for the military. There's no safe way through that mess. Yo, honestly though, oof, I could have probably climbed up on that. Yeah, actually. Kenny, come on. Ah, shit. Damn it. I can't reach. <sighs> Sorry, pal. All right, stay put. My 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 arm just went through the top of that car. But we're we're not gonna talk about that. Oh yeah, we're not gonna go and go and go and talk about it. No, I'm not even gonna roll that barrel over. That's just terrible. Uh. Huh. Oh, there is something I want to see if I can walk down this way. Hmm. Oh, I want to see if I can see uh, Lee's brother from the previous episode because he. Ah, oh, I didn't look in the opening scene. I should have looked in the opening scene. Huh. Fuck. I want to see if Lee's brother is still there. Huh. I just thought about that now. Girl still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. I think she understands. Hope so. Not like we had much choice. Right. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. No. Uh, 
Next time I'm bringing Ben. Help me get out. No! No! Go away! Go! Go! Help me! How long have they been in this shit? Somebody help me! Oh god! Oh god! What the, what the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Gotta do something! Ah! Fuck, we gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. They don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. I don't want her. Uh, see, death by walkers, terrible. I didn't know I could shoot them, but I chose to shoot them. Nah. They're not even dead. Fuck, I helped. I helped. I was helping you escape. But in the middle of one, that in the middle, and decided to shoot a couple of the walkers and help you. Should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. I see, I feel like food is way better than meds. She's gone. There's not much time now. Maybe if I didn't shoot, they wouldn't be coming after me like this, but... Can I get 22 items? I want 22 items. I think I got everything. everything. I got everything. Holy shit. That girl didn't die for nothing then. Up and over. We're still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, Jimmy, help! Help. He did not just think about leaving my ass. He just thought about leaving my ass. But I hate him. I like him and I hate him. <laughs> See, looking more ban that's bandage shit.
You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. You should win the hoodie finally. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. So, what did you get? Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. So, you two are, uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable in it. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? Bro, I uh, it was a fucking mistake. Um, she was you dead anyways. It was a mistake. There was no saving her. Don't take that tone with him. Bro, it's the first I, I was trying to help her. Glad to know you think being a killer is smart. Hey, if you don't agree with it, then we'll take everything we got in these bags and put it in a pile marked "No Hypocrites," and you can use everything else. She was dead anyway made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on Earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies! That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! There's like five people here. Now everybody get out! Ben, Katja, Clem, Kenny, Lee, Billy, Duck. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, rough day, I guess. Yeah, but I've just been calling them days lately. I don't know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now... If she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. Oops, I saw you in my mic. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? 
Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. How's the drawing? Good. I want that fucking... She was talking on the walkie. I want to know what it was about. Like, I want to ask about the pretend conversation. That's all. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I'll talk to you later. See, that was me talking to myself. I just... Hi, guys. Hi, Lee. Oh, that's that. Okay, so it was both of mine. Hey, Doug. Hiya. Where's Duck? What are you working on? I'm just trying to focus on the wall. Anything I'd like to contribute needs batteries or tools I just don't have. I'm tearing down this furniture to patch up the wall. If we go on like this, we'll have half the Travelier piled up out here before we know it. The wall's important. I guess. I feel worthless on watch because I'm not wild about guns, and I just wish I was more helpful. Hmm. Faith has always been a bit of an elusive thing for me. I mean at the motel, as opposed to finding somewhere new. I think if we can get whoever is out there to leave us alone, this is a good place to be. And you know, they sort of stopped attacking. Maybe they forgot about us. Yo, I'd like to just point out there that it completely, it completely skipped that. What do you think about Lily? Dark. I don't know. I guess I'm sad. Nobody deserves to lose their parent like that. You don't think that would make her delusional, do you? I think it could make you anything. Nothing good. I'll catch you later, Doug. Catch you on the flip, Dougie. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend, but what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh, I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... <laughs> Been trying to please everybody. You feel useful to the group? What? Useful? Yeah, how's your spirits? I'm fine. I'm helping, right? Yes. For sure, Ben. For sure. Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. Ben's a nervous fucking wreck. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Broken glass. Bunch of chalk. And why'd I walk all the way over here? Uh, I, I don't know where Duck is. Like to know where Duck is. 
Guess I won't know where Duck is. Okay, Ducky, 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 Ducky. Oh, I guess I should probably go talk to Lily. Technically, the only person I haven't talked to besides Duck. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. It's just a few things, it's not a big Bullshit, deal. it's not. You know it is, and I'd really appreciate the help. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. I found that broken glass earlier. Because, yeah, I found the broken glass. Or at least I believe it to be broken glass. Uh, okay, I can't walk away. I have to walk my ass all the way the fuck around. I've already talked to everybody, really not going to show them. Man. Uh, I just want to go grab with that broken glass, because I fucking found it earlier. Where is it? There it is. think it is I don't think it's anything maybe it's a sign it could be it's pink chalk which is weird okay back to investigating yeah I should probably ask Clem I don't want to poke around. Uh, I see if Ben's seen anything. Hey, Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... Well, my thoughts. And I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. Uh, can I go to Clementine? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. I found something. What is it? 
I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. Cool! Duck thinks you're incredibly awesome. Yeah, honestly though, I like talking to Ben. Ben is just a nervous wreck. You didn't the break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. <laughs> Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Goldfish that tastes like strawberry, even though they're supposed to be original. Before I'll grab a bag. Okay. Son of a bitch. Found the bag. Or stolen drugs. You, you haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while Not you really. sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, Got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep him talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life! <sighs> Shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we got us, that's why! We'll leave you everything. Just let us walk out of here. So you can try to pay us a little visit, leader? Fuck that! All right, I've had enough of this shit. Drew, take these motherfuckers! Christ! Oh shit! Some bad news, bitches. <gasps> Ooh, Doug. Why are there so many? They can't get their get own supplies. Oh my out. fuck. We gotta get out of here! Hell, no man. shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! I shall cover the fuck out of my people. Boom. Go around, shit, the break is back there! No, 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 no. Now! Get over here! Hurry! Yeah, you saved our asses. Get yes. inside! Yes, yes, Ben, I saved your asses. Now I gotta go to the other side. Hide Fuck. Me. Help! Gotta save these Catch motherfuckers. Up. Hang on! 
Tried to back the fuck out. I was trying to figure out how to back out. <laughs> I didn't know how to just move this. As soon as I moved the stick to the left. Uh. Under me! Help! Gotcha! Gotcha! Hang on! Where is he? He's hiding behind that van. Get your ass around behind. There he is. When did he run over there? Why? I why? Why? This is bullshit. Literally bullshit. Bull B S. Whatever. Whatever. Help! I'm gonna shoot that motherfucker first. Gotcha. Hang on. Like, he doesn't run over. Where is he? He just sort of spawns right there. Inside the RV, it's gonna be okay. Go! Oh, fuck, gotcha in their head. No. Oh, Christ. Oh, shit, I missed the first shot. Whew. Oh, shit. Lily, get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. Please, Walker. Shit. Kitty, hurry up with that thing. Right side. Walker's on the right. I got you. Fuck. Doug? Solenoid. Good shit, Doug, you boy. Last chance, get down here. Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm sorry. Calm down. We need to figure out why this happened. Nobody died. We're okay, right? Katya, you're okay? We just lost everything. But we have our health. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Ben, I think we need to talk. Whoa, what? Lily, let's think about this logically, no? Logically? The new guy who could have easily been a plant? I think that's pretty logical, Doug. You think I'd do anything to hurt you guys? Don't play dumb. Were you hoping they'd eventually kill us all and you could join them? Lily, come on. Finn's a good guy. Totally! Well, then who? Being a good guy is enough to clear your name on I this? I didn't do it! Really, honest! I know I don't get wrapped up in the politics around here, but we really need to think before we start stringing somebody up. Doug, I appreciate your concern, but we have all the evidence we need. Let's just let it go. People make mistakes, and yeah, this is a fucking doozy. But it's not worth it, Lily. Then what do we not forgive? Honestly, tell me. Kenny can kill my dad. Ben can steal from us. Where's the line? Just let me out of the car. I'll go. I didn't do it, but I'll go. Good. That sounds great. Lily, look at him. I... Fuck. Jesus, I didn't. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. I... Shit! What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. Alright, well, 
We can deal with this now, then. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily? Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. You put the hazards on, you in the apocalypse. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think thinks. you should chill out. Please, look, it wasn't me. Please stop accusing me. I'm really sorry you're upset, Ben. Just tell us you did it. I'm not doing this. Come on, Lee. You're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. We're out here on the side of the road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh. The hell you will. He's broken, Lily. I can see that. And this? Evidence or not, this isn't any way to treat one of us. I've heard enough out of you, okay, Genevieve? Just give me a damn minute, Walker, to tell me it was you. No! Ben! Lily! This is about to lay off. I can't, Lee. You know I Please can't. Stop. Now! Please, let's just get back in That's the army. That's not how- I got him. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Ben! No! Lily, you son of a bitch. Fuck, Lily. Drop it! Holy fuck. Kenny! What's happening?! Keep duck away from the windows! Jesus Christ! Get in! We're leaving this crazy bitch! I didn't mean to. It wasn't supposed to be him. What are we gonna do with her? Leave her for the walkers. Ken, Lee! Why? Why, Lily? You're not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you. He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Yes. Fucking hell. Were you ever gonna get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. Clem knew. To hell with it. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. I don't have anything left. Shut up, fucking... Oh, you shouldn't even have tried to shoot then. Lee, Fucking. a word, please. I shall go up there, but first I shall talk you to the okay? Clem. Katya needs you for something. I shall talk to the Katya now. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in a group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? 
We thought you should know. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. I tried to tell Kenny that we murdered. I was a murderer. Duck is bitten. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Doug? Gone, but won't come back. Because he was shot in the head. That's right. It's horrible. Yeah, it is. scary though this one time these boys from the other side of town were hassling him he was on his bike and they were in a truck throwing things at him calling their names stuff like that and this tough son of a gun he, he pedals up after him he catches him he pulls his bike up alongside the truck and jumps into the back and starts beating on him he teaches all three of them a lesson but the truck's still moving you see just as he stands up to jump out. It zooms underneath a tree and a branch hits him square in the face. He goes flying out the back. Anyway, if, if he can live through that, I'm sure Duck can live through this. something up ahead. I've been quick about it. Damn it. Roads blocked. Now we gotta deal with this. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That not cross my mind. Yeah, honestly, why don't I just search that car right there, though? Uh, can I search? I can't even search that car, can I? What if I go behind? Uh, I just really want to search this car. Oh wow! I um. Oh, can I look at this? Can I search this car? Jesus! Oh! Oh, he's got food. Animal crackers. Ah, I need 
need something to stab this him. This door's gonna hurt. Okay. You're not gonna like this. And animal crackers. Right, I'm gonna give the animal crackers to Clem. Oh, uh, or, or not. Okay, Kachi, you can get yeah, animal crackers. I found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Oh, God, I don't even know what fucking lines. Like, my lines are so messed up. Like, it just all depends on the situation. Why is the fucking my right oh, ear? He's eating my fucking I don't ear. Know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about it. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Doug. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? I'm used to it by now. We all are, aren't we? She murdered him, Lee. I was there, Kat. I'm sorry. It's like... I, I don't know. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from? Yes. Even further away now. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Hey, man, we're still looking around and haven't figured much out yet. It's fine. Radiator could use a rest as it is. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Uh, me neither. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay, then. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. But... Throw my fucking hair back. It's getting the wave. Things. Let's go in the box car first. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Oh, there's the water. I'll take this to catch up for Doug. Uh, take the map, of course. 
map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. Cam's family is in Savannah, if I remember correctly. Uh, where was my up down here? Uh, nothing to really look at. Uh, damaged car. There's got to be a better pain. way to do this. Alright. Shit. Of course. Broken. Yep. Yeah, I don't want to lie. I don't care enough to look at sheet metal. Found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well... I don't, but you're probably right. So, what I got from that is Kenny wants to use the train, but train, you know, honestly, if you do it like that Snowpiercer movie did, and you just just kept the train going 24-7, and, and we only stopped to refuel this thing, we find, like, refueling areas, that would be great. Because then you could actually just keep using this. Nothing. Uh, ooh, nah. I want a spike mover. Got to take out the spike. one okay so the one on the far left is the engine one one next to that is where oh i grabbed it. that ting the ting the spike remover the bullet and then track the walkers. Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. Benzie, I was so sure. <laughs> sure. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. There's another map that I'd like to grab at. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. I'd still like to grab at it. Okay. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. 
Let's just, yeah, I actually know of a way to read this notepad. I know how to read it. I know how to read it. Let's do this thing that Kem was no doing. Idea what That's not what I was trying is. to do. No. I said, why don't we do the thing that Kem was trying, Kem, Clem was trying to do with the leaf, leaf, the leaf, the leaf. Ooh, actually, all right, I'll talk to There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. I hate that it, like, the audio stops, like, when I was talking to fucking Doug. That, um, okay, well, has they got a newspaper? Oh, that's great. Honestly, because what, what cell phone towers actually, like, go out in the apocalypse? I, got, I know in most versions of the apocalypse, if nobody's there to maintain the, uh, that's, that's from that one game with the dog detective and the rabbit sidekick. I don't remember the name of the game. But, um... Uh, what cell towers go out? That's, like... I don't know. That's my major thing. Because when The Walking... Uh, when The Walking Dead took place... It was, like, months after the fact. So they didn't really have to touch base on some why that happened. Because it was Rick's story. But then if you look at Z Nation, which also took place three years after the fact... See... See, the only one that can really, like, I guess, can tell me why. I'm pretty sure there was a movie on it, but Zombieland. I see, I don't know what Zombieland did with Cell Towers. It's been forever since I've seen Zombieland, and I never watched a Zombieland uh, Double Tap. Then there was another movie that was based off, I cannot remember, Night of the Living Dead. That doesn't matter for the sole reason that it was eight. There's no such thing. Uh, besides the landline. I believe. Oh, fuck. I can't. Uh, what is it? Black Summer on Netflix, which takes place three years before Z Nation. I'm trying to remember what the fuck. I, I don't even... I don't know what happened to Cell Towers. I, I don't know how Cell Towers go out and, like, shows. They sort of just avoid that whole section. But, yeah. Perfect. It's my you rant. can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Six, down, down, up, 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 down, up. Five. Okay, five horizontal, then vertical. Nine, left, right. Okay, I think I remember it now. Should be good. Uh, yeah, I already did it. Oh, uh, yeah. That should be good. Down, down. Up. 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 Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! Yeah. So far, so good. Then five was vertical. I'm uh, not vertical. Sorry. Now five we're talking. Then vertical. Yep. Uh. Okay. And nine, I would like to guess was the primer, which was the furthest one on the left. This being the furthest one on the left, and it says engine compartment. Yep. Nine. I believe it was left first and then right. Holy shit! We're golden! This thing is loud. 
So what? We're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour. I don't care about the noise. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Oh, uh, how? Oh, this is okay. Throw, yeah, it makes sense. I can even cool on. Damn it! Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? And get us unstuck? Yeah. down the wrong pipe. There. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. You touch any of my stuff? for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Is that your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. Well, sort of are stealing this guy's home, so... You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Have candy. Boy got the last piece I got on me. Figures. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. It's scary, kind of. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. Uh, 
That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Um, that's not, uh, I talk exactly like Chuck. I better get back to it. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Absolutely and utterly amazing. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Is the train really a good idea with Duck like that? Maybe we should focus on one thing at a time. Yes. What can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. Oh, my bad, man. Fucking... My earpieces are just eating at my ear for some reason. Like, at both of them. I don't know why. I keep trying to fix them, but whatever. Just roll with it. Wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. I didn't search that fucking body by the tree. I don't know if I could have, but I didn't search it. You gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. There were more of us. Dad, get him? No. Ah, living got him. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Sometimes it just feels like it skips a beat, you know? Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. Stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. 
You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. I don't know what the hell is wrong with you, but you need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? <laughs> yeah, I do. You're acting like nothing's wrong. And somebody's gotta knock some sense into you. I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gone. that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck! I punch him in the face. You want to hurt people because you're afraid? Losing Duck ain't enough for you! Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this! I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen! Boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. What do you need? I. I. Katja. It's time to. Oh, this is not possible. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Can't. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or... Something we can just give him. Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Kenny, you're his dad. You do it. And I'm his mother. Lee's right. And don't give me that I brought him into this world joke. Shush. He's still a baby boy. It would be different if he were older. Let me do this. Then I'm coming with you. No, hon. Stay with Lee. Your son loves you. And you should remember him as the silly boy we used to have. Not this. So lucky that face cam doesn't, I don't do that. So lucky that I don't do that. What's happening? Duck. 
is dying. I know. What is Katya doing? She's putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... No. God! People die. Not anymore. The walkers aren't dead. People don't die anymore. Well, Katja made sure a duck did. I know. I'm gonna go get her. She's probably a mess. Ben, get Clementine on the train, all right? And keep your eyes open. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Why? Cat! Honey? Oh, fucking God! <laughs> She could. She, 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 she just. Oh, 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 fuck! Family has to kill family in the apocalypse. If something goes wrong. Dad, you gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. So lucky there's no fish come. Hey, how you doing?
I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Go she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Kenny ended up shooting his son out there. Dude. What a mess. You said it. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there. About whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless there. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink. You know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? the whiskey. They look clean enough. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. What a crappy day. The crappiest. Three months ago, I don't know what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You're damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Wait, I... Me neither. 
He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. God damn it. Yeah, I don't... You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. <laughs> you okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yes. Yeah, you do. Uh, I think she shot to the left. Get to the right. Came, right? Okay, a little higher. Here we go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Let's see where she misses or hits it this time. go nice oh, I did it on. yeah you did good job I just pretended they were walker heads good just like you should they're not walkers though no far from it but you know how these things work now we'll graduate you to walkers one day Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy said that? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Gotta do it eventually. Do you know how to do this? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I told you that. Back to sorry. Story. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. It doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay, 
I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look oh. dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Ben on the way back, because I have the fucking if I have to uh, give him anyways. Oh, not Ben, Clem. And I think, because Chuck was asking about uh, alcohol, and I have... I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Hell yeah. Sure. Not known for its finish. No kid. <clears throat> Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Still Kenny about it, so I can get it back. Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you. So forget it. Okay. Hey. Yeah? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land. Once we get to Savannah. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Let's uh, snag this motherfucker before he comes back. Thanks. Wow, that was fucking quick. I have to talk to Ben. Oh. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me, kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. His heart was in the right place. You still want to talk to me? Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. This heart is hard. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. Everything will fall apart. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. Fuck, man, my heart's racing. You got anything else you want to say? 
No. Good. You can never tell Kenny. You understand? But... Do not. You don't sell us out to the bandits. They never attack. They never attack. Duck never gets bitten. He'll kill you. I just... I want him to know. Bullshit. You just want to feel better. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See you. Yeah. Oh, fucking Ben. Holy shit, this episode is fucking jam-packed with a bunch of fucking shit. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We should go our own way when we get there. The crew is falling apart. You and I are stronger There's alone. no option. What exists. about the boat? What about Ben? You'll be fine. Okay. Can we at least look for my parents when we get there, before we go? They're dead. We have to move on. They're not dead. Do you want them to be? <laughs> no, no, there's a voice message. Need to separate from the group. We'll look for your parents first. <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't cry. If we don't find them, we can go. But if we do, they come with us. Okay. That's the plan. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. And unless Savannah is somehow walker free, we know we want to stay out of town. Are we going to have to live in the woods? You yes. don't like the woods? I don't like the woods. Well, what I think we should do, after we look for your mom and dad, is head north. Keeping water, the, the ocean on our right side. So we can't get surprised by walkers. Exactly. I like the beach. Good. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the... M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Almost got through the entire. I'd like to assume, because I've been playing this for over an hour, just got through the entire episode without anything going wrong. Uh, what was bound to happen? Well, honestly, I, I couldn't tell you what you missed. 
decides why I'm talking about how we're gonna go over this and this slide. I don't think you really miss anything. You're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody! Walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Define trouble. Anything that gets you killed, or worse. And it tends to come hand in hand with groups of guys in distress. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude! It's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. How the fuck am I supposed to? What am I? How am I so? Oh, right there, of course. If I come up there. You better not be murderers or thieves! I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim, then his mom took her life, and before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Ben's young and stupid, and I think, huh? As you said, don't really go with a third. I know. We just have to keep an eye on him. No sweat. It's been rough for everybody down there. I'm sure you can say the same. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. A for us truck, let's go. That's about the only useful thing in here. No, there's cones. You can do bottle flip. Yeah, cone flip from this high. Uh, not gonna bother with the generator hitch. They sell up here. 
There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan, or what? Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Alright, fine, then we'll head back up. Okay. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, it's been a bit of a day. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like... I think I forgot to say, but I'm gonna go grab food.